Harrison Elementary held a special Thanksgiving celebration yesterday. For this week's Golden Apple, Sarah Winkleman takes us to the Thanksgiving feast where students learned about thankfulness. We have a festival, a Thanksgiving festival. It's a celebration focused on family. We feel like our kids are our family, so it's like I get to sit down with my whole family here. A family that includes 44 kindergarten students and the people that they are thankful for. <laughs> Thanksgiving isn't about food. Thanksgiving is about honoring family. That's why all our families are invited, grandparents, neighbors, whoever is important in your life. I'm thankful for the whole world. In preparation for the feast, the students spend time in the classroom learning about Thanksgiving, something the parents are thankful for. She's getting that history and getting that appreciation and understanding it so early on is just fantastic. I'm thankful for my teacher. We talked about just things we're thankful for, not so much the material things, but like our families and um, our people in our lives. And I had one little one say, I'm thankful for letters, Mrs. Roberts, because then we can learn how to read or just those kind of things and just what it means to be thankful. The day starts off for the kindergartners by drawing on the tables and even making some hand turkeys. It means there's going to be turkeys. In order to really experience what Thanksgiving is, not all our families do, so we make sure that every kindergartner gets that Thanksgiving, authentic Thanksgiving experience. In its now 10th year, the Thanksgiving feast at Harrison is a tradition. Such a great tradition to get families coming together and celebrating our school. One that this school hopes will live on well into the future. Well, the parents talk about it for years, kids come back and talk about it, it's just a super, super cool thing. So. Happy Thanksgiving! For this week's Golden Apple in Brainerd, Sarah Winkleman, Lakeland News. If you've enjoyed this segment of Lakeland News, please consider making a tax-deductible contribution to Lakeland Public Television.